welcome back to another vlog. It is a cold and nasty day today. I got my sweet boy with me. It's pouring down rain and it is freezing again. Yesterday it was um, 70 something degrees. So beautiful. Today it's 39 for the high. <laughs> and, oh, are you nervous? And it's pouring down rain, obviously. But we're um, headed to get Oliver groomed. He's so cool. Why are you shivering? Are you nervous? He gets so excited. He doesn't know where he's going. Of course, he hates going to the groomer, but he's excited to go bye bye right now. We always have to trick Belle. Mar well, Marion distracts her for me. Um, so she doesn't get her feelings hurt because she doesn't like when he leaves. But anyway, listen, Bug, you gotta go over there. So I'm gonna take him, drop him off the groomer, and then I'm gonna go get my nails fixed. I need to get the, um, I got acrylics. If you remember last time, they've grown out so much. So I am gonna get a fill in, new color, not sure what color yet. Listen, <laughs> listen. You see, so this is his before. You see how crazy he looks looks like a big giant teddy bear but he's gonna look totally different okay my bubble i'm gonna get the heater on so we gotta go He is dropped off. Everything is so much more difficult when it's pouring down rain. And he always likes like such a baby. He's so scared, but the girl that does him is so good and he's fine. But as soon as we got in there, he pooped all over the floor. So I was like, great, Oliver. He, it's just because he's nervous and all the smells. But anyway, I'm gonna, I don't know if you could see this. I'm gonna run and get my nails done. So I don't know if you watch my other vlogs about my nails, I did the dip, I've always done gel, and then I decided to do dip powder, and then I did that once, and then I went in and she convinced me to do the acrylics, telling me that they would last so much longer, and so it's been, tomorrow will be four weeks, and look at it, not a chip, nothing, so they've just grown out a lot, so I'm gonna get her to fill in the, you know, fill it in, also cut them, because my nails are never this long, and when I edit, it just makes it difficult when you have longer all this is super short to some people anyway and then a new color so hopefully she can get this done sometimes I have to wait like over an hour or wait an hour and before they can even do it so I'm hoping it's not that way today <laughs> in and out they did good this time I had the sweetest girl do my nails I think I'm gonna make an appointment with her an appointment with her next time her name was Katie she did so good so I got this like really pale almost I don't know almost white but light pink <laughs> color I've had it before you know I love pink I always tend to get pink nails she did such a good job and these look like those like press on like I don't know she was amazing I'm definitely getting her next time and they're not as thick as they were last time gosh she did amazing anyway I love when you don't you love when you find like a good one so I can now I can know who to ask for but it is a little after two I have to get Jackson a little after three so I'm gonna run to Walmart and get a few things I am gonna be doing I'm making dinner tonight but I'm also gonna be doing some cooking for my niece she's a nursing student and she is super busy and so I said I would do some cooking for her so I need to go pick up a few things from Walmart so and then I'll be getting Jackson and anytime this rain wants to stop would be nice because it's annoying when you got to run errands
We got Jackson and now we're headed in here to pick up Ollie. It was the perfect timing. He's wearing shorts and t-shirt in this freezing cold weather. It's, warm. it's literally in the 30s. You can it see it's not breath. warm. Yeah, oh, you I thought it was like in the 50s. Oh no, it's in the 30s. There's my naked boy. <laughs> Oliver. Come here, Bubba. We're gonna go this way. Hey, handsome boy. You are cute. Okay, you two crazies. What are you doing? Are you so happy to be home? I gotta give Belle a bath now. I like to bathe him at the same time. I like to bathe her when he gets bathed and shaved. That way I know I can keep track that they were bathed on the same day. But we got him home. I'm home for the night. It's 3.45. It is so rainy and so cold. And it was such a nasty day to have to run errands. But I'm home now. I don't have to do, worry about it anymore. But I got some stuff at Walmart. So I thought I'd show you. Like I said, I'm doing some meal planning for my niece. So I have like... I went to my mom's yesterday and she gave me like some chicken and broccoli and green beans. And so I have like... I'm going to do that for her with like some rice. And then I'm going to do some breakfast burritos. So... I'm just gonna show you what I picked up at Walmart. So I'm gonna do breakfast burritos with, like I do uh, mine. I've not bought these tortillas before, but I just bought that brand. I'm gonna do sausage, egg, potato, and I might do the little like egg cups with bell pepper and sausage and cheese. So anyways, I got all that. I got this Caesar salad kit for us to have with dinner. For dinner, I'm gonna be sharing a recipe. And I didn't have enough ground beef, so I just picked this. They only had this big one, so I am going to divide this up, and we'll use some tonight. I got Jackson's Fruit Punch. And then I'm going to do some chicken and rice for her. So I got the General So's. This is the House of Tang. I've heard this is really good. I've never tried it, but I love General So's chicken. So I'm going to do that for some uh, dishes for my niece, and then I'll save the rest, and we'll try it sometime. And then I got... These are mine and Marion's favorite, but I prefer the mini robin eggs. And so, we, you know, you can only get them at Easter time. So I saw them and I grabbed them. And then also Marion loves these hot tamale peeps. So got those for him. I got a couple little storage, food storage containers. These are 98 cents for two of them. So those will be for my niece. And then they had their sweatpants, boys sweatpants for four bucks. So Jackson is literally like outgrowing his pants by the day. So I needed some, just some sweatpants for him. So I got these and then a green pair and he has the shirt to match the green one. He's actually wearing it now. We're going to put Ollie's sweater on at least for while it's still cold. Oh my goodness, there's my boy. <laughs> oh, this looks too small for you, Popo. -po. Are you are you getting bigger? Is it too small? Hold on. Let's take this off. Hey Belle Belle. Sweet girl. You enjoy sweet girl. You want a sweet girl. Hold on, Ollie. Is that too tight, sweet lover? Come here. Come here. You have to have this on. Good boy. Good boy, Ollie. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go, my little baby. There we go. What? You're so cute. Oh my goodness, you're so cute. You're so cute. You're so cute, too. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're such a good girl. Did you miss your brother today? Did you miss him all day? <laughs> Take out my handsome sweater on. And now I'm toasty warm because I'm looking like a naked mole rat. Yeah. You so handsome, huh? You so handsome now? Yeah. I got new Soresto collars. I need to put these on my dogs. I've had them for a couple weeks and I need to put them on. Oliver's was on him, but he was so fluffy I was afraid it was too tight. So I took it off about a week ago, but I need to replace them. These are what we use for flea and tick control and they're amazing and they last eight months. Okay, so I figured I'd go ahead and start. It's only 424, but I'm gonna go ahead and get a few things started. So, cause I have a lot to cook tonight. So this is the shredded potatoes, which will be for the uh, breakfast burritos. I'm heating up some oil and I'm just gonna heat, uh, cook this thin sliced chicken. And then I have some rice going in the rice cooker. I also have a big thing of green beans. I think I'm also going to use some of these for dinner tonight because I won't need this whole thing for her food. And this is the better than bouillon. I just went ahead and let it um, 
you know dissolve into the water I'll use that later for our dinner but I'm gonna go ahead and just do this in stages otherwise you know it's gonna I'm gonna be in the kitchen all night but I'm gonna try this with this with this with the rice I also have broccoli that that'll be easy but I'm gonna cook it in the microwave and then chop it up plate it together and I made homemade mac and cheese last night and I had a lot extra so I'm gonna do homemade mac and cheese with some of these buffalo style chicken breasts so I'll have to cook those after uh, to shred some cheese I have this big pan for our dinner so I'm gonna link the recipe down below for what I'm making let me see what it's called again it's called cheesy ground beef and rice casserole and I'm making a, some substitutions like always and I always try to tell people like you do it to suit your taste like don't be afraid to change things up in a recipe like it calls for cream of mushroom soup and mushrooms I don't like mushrooms I do eat cream of mushroom soup but I thought this time that I would just change it up a little bit so I got cream of celery just because that's what I want and I'm not gonna add the mushrooms to this and then it also um, there's different it, she tells you like different variations if you want to change it up it also says you can add like frozen corn carrots peas I might add that I don't know I, I've got to see if I have any but um, and then if you cook your if you don't if you want to cook your rice beforehand you can do that and then just put it in cooked or you can cook it all together in the pan I haven't decided what I'm gonna do since I'm using my rice cooker I might just do it all in the pan I was just gonna cook it in the rice cooker and be done with it and not worry about it because I never cook rice on the stove because it never turns out but I'm gonna I'll probably try it this time there's just different things that you can do to switch it up so I'm gonna link that recipe down below and I'll try to show you you know as I'm making that it's just a simple one pot meal and then you Put it in the oven with cheese on top and let it melt should be super easy and she says it's delicious so i will link it down below all right so the first thing i'm doing is ground browning a pound of ground beef and then i'm going to add some italian seasoning and i think salt and pepper The recipe says, sorry that chicken's so loud. The recipe says to cook the meat and then add butter and onions and cook them together. But I'm just gonna add my onions and butter into this with some Italian seasoning and salt and pepper. But I'm not gonna use as much Italian seasoning as they call for just cause I'm not crazy about it. So I'm not gonna put as much. Okay, so I decided to go ahead and just cook the rice in the rice cooker um, I finished with the other rice so I just washed it out and instead of water I, I put the better than bouillon with the water to cook it in so hopefully that will give it a lot of flavor I'm just gonna go ahead and this takes about 20 minutes and then I can add it to my pot
Okay, so now that my rice is finished in the rice cooker, I'm just gonna go ahead and add all these things to this pot. The rice and then cream of celery. Half a cup of sour cream. I was supposed to add garlic before and I didn't, so I'm just gonna add it now. And I don't measure garlic either. One more tablespoon of butter. And a half cup of milk. And about one cup or so of cheese. <laughs> don't measure cheese usually either. here top it with cheese and put it in the oven at 350 for 20 minutes so now that that's cooking in the oven I'm gonna go ahead and finish the breakfast burritos I'm just doing half a pound of sausage with about a half a bell pepper. And then I did the um, shredded potatoes, I shredded up some cheese. And after this sausage is done, I'm just gonna crack the eggs into the same pan and just mix it all together. It'll just make it easier, it all tastes the same. And then I'll make the burritos so that she can freeze those and have them, you know, whenever she's needing one. I got four General Tso's chicken and broccoli and rice, two of the buffalo chicken mac and cheese and green beans, some Aussie bites that I froze from Sam's, thought I'd give her some of those, and then I made 10 sausage, egg, potato, cheese, 
<laughs> breakfast burritos and they are really full so that should hold her over for a while and the funny thing is she's about a hundred pounds so <laughs> she's probably it's gonna take her a long time to eat that she's so tiny and she doesn't hardly eat much at all each one of those is probably two meals for her Taste this cheesy beef and rice, and Patrick's behind the camera. I am. That's true. He's gonna taste it too. I'm sure. Oh, I'm, he will. I am certain of that. I am certain I will. That's good. Ooh. It's good. You can taste the sour cream, and I do not like sour cream, but I she can doesn't. eat it in things. Like I'm, that's good. Ah. And I got a the my favorite salad, the Caesar chop salad. Ooh. What is it called? I don't Chopped know. Caesar salad from Walmart. Nice. So good. And then I gave them green beans. I don't do green beans. And Jackson already ate. All right. All that cooking in my kitchen is a disaster. So I'm going to go ahead and unload and reload. I don't, I've taken some things out of here, but I'm going to go ahead and clean this kitchen.
kind of nuts. I think I've been in the kitchen for three hours total, except for the 10 minutes it took me to eat dinner. But um, the kitchen is clean, dishwasher's going. I have not done my floors. I still need to do all the floors in the house, but I'm gonna sit down right now with Patrick <laughs> Bell and uh, work on his budget so we can get that done. I need to wipe the top of that. <laughs> uh, yeah, gonna do that before I do the floors. Well, Patrick came down to see what Marion's doing. This basin has still got so much sawdust. Oh, look at this. Erica, holy moly. Look at oh, yeah. We got this heater from Patrick. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. What? 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 This, is, this is... I'm the staging dog. So, uh... Ooh. Man, I gotta get you some curtains for that window. We got those that two rugs from Ollie's. I found um, some pictures on Pinterest how you can make the brick wall look really cool. So I'm gonna show you and see if you like any of them, oh. Marion. Are you gonna do it? Yeah, if you like any of them. But what is today? Thursday. 24th. So, huh? The 24th. 24th. So uh, Saturday, yeah. We're gonna come down. Well, I think Saturday. I don't know. Pretty soon, Saturday, Sunday. We're gonna come down Mary, here. I'm so happy I mean, obviously, this, he's already doing a lot, but this, uh, that, uh, what are you doing? Yeah. You my sweet love. You are too cute. You know you can come down here. This is amazing. You know you can come down, my love. You know. You're so cute. Are you sad because you're naked now? Are you sad? Because but you're so bald, my, um, but you're so handsome. All right, we worked on the budget, got it figured out. Jack, Jackson is helping um, Patrick yes. with this, you know, because he has a head injury, so he is difficult to like read stuff, but he loves to, he loves to read, but it's kind of difficult. So what is it called? Okay. Speechify? Speechify. He downloaded this app called Speechify and Jackson's helping this, him. And it, like you, you take oh, a picture oh, of God. what you want to oh, read and it reads it to you. Okay. He okay. loves to follow so along, but it's oh, it, it, the words get all jumbled um, up sometimes. So anyway, no. Jackson just, and his, the ones that you want he's very technically I, savvy. I he's like his dad. Back, so okay? anyway, so then, I am um, going to close the video for now. You Thank sure? you for hanging out with sure me us today. <laughs> this is the audience clapping in yeah. sign language. Yes. The audience is clapping. Yay. And we still going like this, y'all. A lot of people are doing this. Y'all. <laughs> when I said, when I said I was gonna close the video, he would looked up like me. I want to say something. So <laughs> well, like, you know, you know. <laughs> anyway, um, um, yeah, I'm sure, I yeah, was yeah, I, I, reading yeah, comments so today. I put the video up, and I was asking y'all like shorter or longer vlogs. Okay. So, like, um, Basically, everyone said so longer. There's a couple that said shorter, but um, I like doing longer vlogs. It's just what I like doing. Like, so I knew, uh, when you're filming, you never really know how much footage you've got, but you kind of have an idea. I kind of have an idea now. I pretty much know like if it's going to be a shorter or longer vlog. So this would probably just be an average vlog. But thank you so much for hanging out with us. I hope that you enjoy this vlog. It was a little bit of cooking and cleaning which is it was a lot of cooking but for me but um pretty much like all my videos so just because it's there anyway love you guys and i will see you in my next video bye bye